can count on continues with Jessica Starbird Sports Report. The Leo Lions continue to be the queens of the jungle on the diamond. Ranked, 4A, ranked in 4A, Leo took down state ranked winger 20 to nothing on Friday night. We are proud to honor the Leo softball team as your Optimum Performance Sports Team of the Week. Optimum Performance Sports is a proud sponsor of this week's Team of the Week. Way to go, athletes and coaches. We are here with the Leo Lions softball team off to a 12 and 3 start this season. Ben Chappelle is their head coach. Another strong start for Leo. What has this group brought to the table? Uh, this group is a, a bunch of hard workers. Uh, they've definitely uh, put in the time in the off season, and it's shown this year, especially with our power numbers. We have more home runs this year than we had all last year already. So uh, they can uh, definitely put the ball um, in play at different places, but over the fence is even better. So it's been a great season for that. And talking about runs scored, a 20 to nothing victory over a Dwanger team ranked in 3A. How important was that victory in building confidence? Yeah, the girls always get up for the Dwanger game. It's a good rivalry for us. Um, we know that they're always a good team, and so that's a, a good measuring stick for us. Um, so they came out ready to play. That was one of the better games we played, you know, in the last couple of years, um, and that showed in the score. So. Well, we're going to put their speed now to the test as our fantastic news staff keeps a close eye on the presidential races and all the primary races going on today. We are going to race two of the seniors on this Leo team. We've got Madeline McDonald and Brooke Immel. They are going to race around the bases, and whoever wins will score an interview with News Channel 15. All right, Brooke and Madeline, are you ready? Everybody behind you guys can cheer and get all excited. All right, on your mark, get set, go. Okay, so I told them that they could be as competitive. They have to touch all the bases. Both touch first. They both touch second. It looks like Madeline has a lead. We've got a couple of finish line officials. Oh, and with a trip up down the third base line from Brooke, Madeline, you took home the championship. Madeline, they said that you were pretty competitive. Did you cause that trip up down there? Um, no, I didn't. <laughs> she jumped on her own. Madeline, you guys are off to a strong start, 2-0 in the conference. You won the state championship in 2014, made it to the four-way state championship game in 2015. How do you guys make it back there in 2016? We just have to make sure we keep working hard and never let up because teams are going to have a target on us, so we just have to never give up. Well, congratulations, Madeline, on your win, and congratulations to the Leo softball team, your team of the week. Brooke, an absolute champ there for getting back up after that fall. Oh, yeah. No 